What's so funny? Huh? What is so funny? I haven't even... Did you see a smile on my face? No. What's so funny over there? What you laughing at? <laughs> no. That I, Marisa told me you went to the supermarket with this already. Yeah, I did. I didn't make it home. You didn't make it? You didn't make it home? No. And how, what happened? How did you bring it back? Tough truck. Hi, Jesse. <laughs> I bought a car. It's a piece of shit on four wheels. My wife hates the fucking car. It leaks oil from all of the fucking seals. The lady across the street is a cunt. She calls the town on me when I work on the fucking car. Welcome to my car show asshole. It's the day after Christmas. Merry Christmas, everybody. I know, what is it, March? It's probably March right now, if you're watching, because oh, our show is on a two-month a two month delay. That's right, because, you know, I don't have... Uh, I work a full-time job. I can't edit all day long. Anyhow. So we got a Christmas present here. And what is it? It's a tachometer. My wife got me this tachometer. I asked for it. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? It's a retro-inspired uh, you know, uh, autometer tachometer there. Yes. I Originally, I wanted to get like an old like Dixco or like Stuart Warner, like a vintage gauge off of eBay. But they're asking a million dollars for them. They're asking like 300 350 for them. And then you don't even know if they, if they break on you the next day, you're out. So I'm like, ah, fuck that. I said, but this one was $189. Come on, give me a break for this thing. I guess that's the, the way things are going now. So, I mean, it was a gift. I don't know if we, could, if we should tack that on to our overall price. I know, we should tack it on, right? Anyway, let's put a tachometer in a car that doesn't even run. Doesn't that sound like fun yet? Yeah, we still have a blown rear. So let's get it in there. Anyhow. That's fun. It's always fun to explain to somebody how my piece of shit car got towed, towed home. By the way, when the tow truck pulled up to the house, I went inside to get the money for the tow truck driver. And my son goes, Dada, what happened to your stupid, dirty car? I said, I broke down, son. Well, you know. And it, it doesn't end here. Look at this. This is where I wanted to mount this. Come on. Why does my life got to be a living hell? We can't mount it here. Shit. Ah, boy. Where do you want your tachometer? Right here. Right here over there. I guess we're going to have to put it up here. Right like that. It's a little aggressive. <laughs> this is basically... You, you, you call... Look at this, guys. Your car better be fucking fast if you're putting your tachometer up here, right? And the simple fact is our car isn't fast. So that's a little much, but that's where it's gotta go. Take this off and we'll mount this sucker right here. That's it, and we'll wire it down into this thing. I don't know, I'll drill a hole in it. It doesn't matter if I drill a hole in it. Look, It looks like fucking hell anyhow. Right, maybe we turn it just a little bit. Wow. wires can go right down here okay 
That's the guy. That's the guy that always drives his pickup past here. I don't know. I think because he, he's. I think because he's got an old car. He thinks we're like best friends now. But all he does is rev the engine as he goes by. He doesn't stop and say hello. So I mean, what am I supposed to do with that? Anyway, we gotta take out this dash, this uh, this trim here. It's it's the it's the fucking car guy's equivalent of like a gorilla beating on his chest. Watch, he'll come back. He just takes his car out once in a while to start the engine and drive by while I'm working. He sees me working out here, and then he's gotta he's gotta drive by. Whatever, whatever gets his dick hard. I don't care. I mean, honestly, just come by and say hello, you know? We'll talk about, I'll talk about your truck. It, we'll talk about my car. Maybe you got something I need. Maybe I got something you need. I doubt I have anything you need, but because he has a nice truck. <laughs> he has a nice car. I don't. Wow, look at that. Oh, they used to be vinyl. Look at that. Back in the day, huh? Why can't I? I should be able to get this thing out now. Hold on. Do we have to go through all this? This thing should come out now. Hey, now that I got this thing out, oh, I thought I had it out. No? There it goes. Um, um, yeah, maybe we could use the uh, planishing hammer on that. Uh, um, um, um. All right, we're going to drill this hole and we're going to grommet it. Very exciting. So here we go. <clears throat> we got the grommet here, which is about yay big. So we have to drill almost the end of the stepper bit to, to right here. And that'll give us the ability to use this piece of shit. <laughs> That's big. The sun is going to hit. There's going to be one hot day in the summertime. This is just going to crack. But we'll be able to feed that down like that. And that'll go to the back of the tachometer. So that's... Oh, we're home. So now our grommet goes into here. like that and then this can go down in there like that oh we just we just missed him you see him pulling in he just drove by me and basically did a burnout at the stop sign it's like come on guy enough is enough you see him down there there he is yeah he went for his uh three minute weekly drive these are the guys that have classic cars and all they do with them is they drive to 7-Eleven to get coffee. <laughs> you ever see these guys? Anyhow, that'll be us. All right. Come on, baby. Get under there. That's it. Get under there, baby. What a fit. Doing. Oh boy, that went awry. Can't find the hole. Go back. Oh, come on. God damn you to fucking hell. What the fuck happened? I'm in the most uncomfortable spot imaginable to mankind. Okay, you're in. That's it. Put these wires down the hatch. Hopefully they go with it <laughs> somewhere where I can find them. God damn it. Where is it? Oh, here it is. All right, the green one. Which it, I, I love these with these wires. They're all different lengths. Thanks a lot, auto meter. Go where you're supposed to go, please. Go where you're supposed to go, please. I got the black one. Where's the red one? 
Oh, mother's ass. Your mother's filthy ass. Got him. Got him. Oh, and the wires were supposed to go through the hoop. I'm a moron. No. Oh shit, there goes the tack. There goes the $189 tack. Now we can work like gentlemen. All right. Unscrew one side. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Now, we cut this. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, let's get a screw, another screwdriver, and we'll seal the deal on that. Oh, okay. That shouldn't move. Wow. I like it. I like it. Look at that. I don't know if you can see what this would be my view right here. All right. So right where my eyes would be. The sun's not really cooperating. But look at that. Oh yeah. <laughs> okay, so now we got some wiring to do. So our wires are coming out down here. Okay. And we have a black. I'm assuming ground. I'm assuming power. The white. This goes to the negative on the coil, the green, the long one, right? And the white one, I have no idea. And I lost my instruction. No, here's my instruction. All right, so let's figure this out and then we'll come back to wire. Take our fuse box, cover off. Notice I didn't label anything. One thing I labeled and then I got lazy. So I don't know where any of these wires go. It's a mystery. So we have, I cut the, I made the wrong thing here. That's all right. Oh, shit. So this is the white and the red. This is the ignition and the light. I'm just going to have this thing turn the light on when the car turns on. I don't, I don't have time for all this dash light nonsense. Let me get my screwdriver. I love this fuse box. Tighten that. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Right, and that'll get a one amp fuse. And then the black wire goes to a ground block, which we have up here, like that. And then our green wire, which the camera's on top of right now. Okay. The green wire passes through the firewall I guess we'll go <sighs> above everything else, right through here. Then we can grab this under the hood. Here we go, here's our green wire. And we'll snake her up right along here. Get the wall, take all the slack out. Right there. And we'll cut that lady right here. Let's not lose this nut. That wouldn't be good. Put this on here like so. Oh yeah. And then let's not lose this nut again. I have like arthritis or something. Because everything hurts. <laughs> you know? Getting fucking old. Oh, come on. Guys, I think we're in business. Do! Let's, let's push this wire down. Okay. So, we got everything wired up. And we have the wires taped up, except for the green wire, because that's going out through the firewall. And we put a five amp fuse in there. They recommended a two amp fuse, but we put a fiver in there. That'll do. 
Guys, let's start it up. This is gonna be like a tachometer slash cold start. Cause I haven't started it in a couple weeks. Uh, even though it's like 55 degrees out, not exactly a cold start. Let's start the damn thing. And here is the moment of truth. Look at that beauty, huh? All right, here we go, guys. Choke. And... That's not the choke of chokes. This is choke. Here we go. Choke out. Oh, wow, what are we doing? Like 400 RPM here? Christmas gift. Merry Christmas. <laughs> 